Hi, Terry Van Noy. Welcome to Math Class with Terry V. Hope this video helps you out, and if you enjoy it, please share it, comment, or like it. And you can also go to my website, mathpowerline.com. It's a math resource blog, uh, lesson videos for students, and other resources for parents and teachers. Give me a call, or go to my website or email. All right, let's go to today's lesson. This question is about a congruence statement between two congruent triangles. If you look at my diagram, you notice that triangle GHI is congruent to the other triangle, but we have to make sure that we list the letters in the correct order so the corresponding parts match up. If I look at the triangles, I notice that segment GH has to be the same length as segment LJ. And I also notice that HI looks congruent to LK. And the longest side, GI, in the one triangle matches up with the longest side, JK, in the other. Can you tell me what the congruence statement should be? That's right. It is going to be triangle GHI is congruent to JLK. It must be written in that order to show the parts that are congruent. So, notice also that my points need to match up and we use this double arrow symbol showing corresponds. So point G corresponds to point J. Point H corresponds to point L, that's right. And point I in one triangle corresponds to point K in the other. And of course our angles and our segments must match up too. So for the angles Angle G must be congruent to what other angle? That's right. Angle J. Angle H is congruent to what angle? Right. Angle L. That's where the right angle is. And angle I is congruent to angle K. Now I would like you to write the segment pairs that are congruent. That's right. Notice that GI must be congruent to which one? That's right, JK. Segment HI is congruent to LK. And finally, segment GH is congruent to which one? J L. So all three parts, the angles, the corresponding points, and the corresponding segments can be concluded from this congruence statement. All right, there you have it. I invite you to go to my website now, mathpowerline.com, or email me or give me a call. The way I work best with students is live online in my classroom. So if I can help you in any way, answer some specific questions, the first lesson with me is free as I show you how everything works. All right, study hard and take care.